If you like my YouTube show, hit like and comment, get involved. Mm -do -do -do. One, two, one, two, one, two, oh, that's better. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. All right, we are a go go. We are a go go. Shmoolulu. Right, that goes there, and that goes there, and that goes there, and there we go. Splendid. Mm. Asthma. <laughs> Hello, man. Caught me eating dinner. Can you hear it all? Can you hear everything? How you doing, lamb? Yoda lamb. Um, yeah, dinner was uh, a little bit delayed, so I... Uh... Hey, Mark. You're, you're just going to have to eat dinner with me for a little while. I've got coffee. I've got chips. And vegetarian burger. Nice, huh? Sounds cool. Excellent, eh? Mm. <laughs> Can you hear me eating? Mm. This is pretty good. Mm. Mm. Overall level, it's redlining on here almost. Homemade, no. Don't think so. <laughs> it's a bit strange, isn't it? <laughs> right on. So here's the guitar I fucked up. <laughs> All switches are working. Dingly dangly. Hey Steve, how you doing? Welcome to dinner. Ian's here. Yeah, man. Does it sound good? Not another one. This is the one I mucked up, apparently. Or do I muck them all up? I don't know. Yeah, it's sweet, isn't it? Sweet, baby. If it's um, clipping, let me know. Yeah, man. Lovely, love it. Sorry, I'm eating my dinner at the same time. So how is all my lovelies? Um, what's all this f thing you've set up with Freddy? You bunch of weirdos. <laughs> I've perfected it. I um, Coming from you, Lamb, that's a, that's a very good compliment. Thank you very much. 
really hungry. <laughs> so this is an unscheduled stream. And why not? Clint's here! He's here for the... <laughs> Sorry, that's blocked. He's here for the nipples and knobs. We're going to go through my nipples and knobs in a minute. <laughs> Starving. I haven't eaten since the last time. Mmm. <laughs> You've cleaned it. You're ready, are you? <laughs> Where is he? He's over there. He's hiding because he knows. He knows he's uh, been invited to a barbecue and that only means one thing. <laughs> We're going to have unicorn burgers. <laughs> this is a bit weird, isn't it? Watching me eat. You want to see he's still alive? <laughs> you know that you know unicorns don't exist, don't you? You are aware. They're just a figment of your imagination. <laughs> Mum, I can't share. Have some virtual chips. There you go, chip. <laughs> So I did a, um, I don't know if you saw it, but I did a very quick video today for my friend about the Vox Tone Room, because he's thinking of buying one, and he wanted to know about that. I don't know if you saw that, that was quite quite a quick one, I threw together for him really, but I, put it, I thought I'd put it up. <laughs> yeah, they're fries, not chips, they're skinny. Ow. Look, he's over there. Hang on. It's a mess in here. I haven't tied it up. <sighs> Hello, everybody. I'm all right. Thank you. See? He's all right. <laughs> Cheers, Clint. The Vox is a very, very good thing, but it's just a real shame that you can't use... Home room in your in your DAW or whatever. You just you can only use it for programming the amp, which is a real bummer, really. And the headphone out on it's rubbish because it bypasses the valve. Yeah, it would have just finished it off, wouldn't it? Would have been really good because it's really got some really good sounds on there. If I could just use it. It's really frustrating because you've got it on your computer and it's there, and you're like, oh, I don't want it. It's annoying, but it's just one of those things. I don't know if there's a way around it. <laughs> I'm fattening him up. Ready for the barbecue. <laughs> Furs. <laughs> Have you heard this? Have you heard this thing they've created because of you? Go sit down there and think about what you've done. <laughs> it's not a children's channel if you're new. Very much the opposite. Actually, not very much the opposite at all. It's the weirdest channel I know, right? <laughs> Trust me to not be normal. I've never been normal my whole life. Mm. Did you see what I just did? See, that wasn't normal. I'm poking chips into my burger. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Simon's had one for 10 years. No matter what he does, he hates the thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, weird is more of an interesting than the alternative. Yeah, agree. <laughs> it's a tone burger, yes. It makes all the difference. If you eat a burger, this is a vegetarian burger, 
before you play guitar, you'll, you'll sound much better. It's true. Because the, the tone of the burger resonates through your body. <laughs> Maybe we should make guitar out of burgers. Hmm. Are you bored yet watching me eat? So I'm nearly there. I'm nearly there. And then we'll do and then we'll demo the uh the guitar I'm up. Oh <laughs> the same with cocaine. <laughs> well on the guitar or in the body or in your body. Or in the burger. Cocaine burger. Damn it, there's a chip on the floor now. Sorry, a fry. So I'm not drinking any beer or any wine. We're, we're cutting it out for a minute because I've been drinking too much, you know? Not good. So coffee and bed early. And I can do um, about 100 Jack Russell bicep curls now. And if I use a banana, I can do about 2,000. <laughs> Nobody likes a quitter. <laughs> it was getting a bit silly, though, you know. It's like, um, it's like we're on holiday, not on lockdown. Use my arm. <laughs> Use my arm, please. Sorry. <coughs> Is it a magic banana? Yeah. It's plastic. Right. <laughs> no, Freddy's not... Um, He's not really allowed to have much contact with me because of the no unicorn policy. But I do bend the rules for him occasionally. It's it's like a you know, it's a hate hate relationship with me and Freddie. You give he's one of these uh, unicorns that if you give him an inch he'll take a mile, you know? You try and take over. So I've got to keep him in his place. <laughs> right. I'm there. This is it. Last ones. So the power by the power of bicep grease and salt and vinegar. I'm gonna it's gonna be slick now, isn't it? As promised, I'm going to flick my nipples. I've got four nipples. <laughs> it's a love-hate relationship. You hate him, but he loves you. No, it's a... I love to hate him. <laughs> That's more like it. the same logic but I'm rolling stoned from start to finish. <laughs> you lot have been crazy on Discord lately I've got to say. Anyway, um, <laughs> so if you didn't see the video I'll quickly do it, I'll run through it for you, look. So this pick up here you can flip from parallel to series with this switch here. So this is parallel. No, sorry, this is series. If you flick that, it goes to parallel. I might put this I might do it in here. It'd be part of this monster build. And if I flick this switch down here, it course splits this pickup. rather nice isn't it then if you go to here position is it position two is that position two we'll, we'll call it position two um, 
this brings in the middle, right? Like it normally would. So you can have the humbucker in series and the middle. Obviously cool, split that if you want to. Or you can put this into uh, parallel. Get confused. They're all very subtle differences, but the good one, one I really like, is you can put this now out of phase, like this. Which is lovely. Convention is one, is bridge, oh it's the other way around is it? Okay, so that's position four then. Right? So I'd look at it as one, two, three, four, I don't know. Whatever. Alright? So that's in and out of phase with the middle and the. Which is cool. Then you can have the middle on its own. Like so. And then you can go down to hit was this position two. Am I right? Position two. So now we've got humbucker here and middle. That's humbucker in the middle. Put it out of phase. It's very toppy. Then we can have the humbucker. Then I can turn this humbucker on with that humbucker. Put this one in series. Or cool split it. And then if I go to position two, position two, we can have all three pickups on, like so. Put this one out of phase. Cool tap this one. <laughs> And so on, and that's about it, I think. So there's lots and lots of choices, and they all work. Because I mucked it up, apparently. There you go. Doesn't sound mucked up to me. <sighs> so. Ba -da -da -da. I'd put some LEDs. <laughs> Sounds like Wayne's World in position two, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it will be mine. Oh yes, um, it is. Well, yeah, it's kind of a custom build. Chris said, kind of. This is the a scratch plate that I've I've been working on for a few weeks and done all this crazy stuff to it. This is a Yamaha Pacifica body. Doesn't quite fit the scratch plate, but I'm gonna make it fit, and I'm gonna sand all this down, repaint it, and stuff. So yeah, it's still in progress, but the electrics are almost done because I'm getting sent a uh, a surprise to put into it. I'm looking forward to. Uh, put some LEDs near the pickups. Yeah, green is on, red is serial. Yeah, yeah, that would be a good idea actually. I'm kind of getting my head around where it all is now. I'm kind of, but sometimes I get confused because it's a lot of combinations. But I'll play something in a minute to a backing track, and you can have a listen. Um. Mm -mm. It's got a kill switch, sort of, because if you put it in, if you put this humbucker in series, you can't call split it. It kills all the sounds. So you've got a kind of kill switch, so you can do that kind of thing there. You know what I mean? Which is kind of cool. <laughs> so that's something else it does. Um. Uh, 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 sorry, I'm reading back. Where does why does everyone want to come front? Of, what does everyone want? It? So they can do that. So they can do this. And all that stuff. Um. <coughs> I didn't put the kill switch in on purpose, it just kind of happened that it does that. 
<laughs> an LCD screen to show the settings. Yeah, that could be interesting. Um, has there been any updates on the Incredible Hulk 335 since the spray in the backyard? No, no, I haven't done anything on it for a while actually. Um, I plan on actually doing some stuff tomorrow and getting it ready. And I was going to ask uh, my knowledgeable uh, community advice on wiring it because it doesn't have obviously access panel. You have to do it all through the f holes, and uh, what would be the easiest way to do that? Would it be easy just to make the circuitry first and then try and put it all in? Probably. Um, I wonder if there's any tricks that I could uh, get off you people because I can see that being a nightmare. <laughs> LEDs would be a good idea. I might do that. I've, got, I've actually got some LED strips, so I could do that. <laughs> do one GPS. <laughs> Jazz bass kit. Yeah. Hello, Slimpix from Vegas. How are you? Don't live high. Do some Morello stuff. Morello. I don't really. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I've listened to Morello. Good, good player. Uh, uh. So I'm just reading. If not LEDs, I think differently styled switches would be more tactile as you grab each. More f feel memory. Yeah. Could do it. They're called f holes for a reason, yeah. I bet. I'm look. I'm not looking forward to it. But I'm at the polishing stage at the moment, so I need. To, I need to do the polishing and, you know, the wet, the wet sanding and stuff. Which I don't know. I don't know if I'll make a video on that. To be honest, it's very boring. Ah, okay. That's a good tip. The TV Jones site. They have videos show, of hollow body wiring. Yeah, I might need it. to a piece of cardboard and then shoehorn it in so get the like the get it yeah so if I like have a piece of cardboard and then mark where the holes are and then wire it so it's all neat and then I should be able to just <laughs> he says get it in there without breaking any of the connections yeah or just give him one volume for all pickups <laughs> <laughs> Wilkinson humbuck is well nice. And do you think I should do a trim on this, or should I just keep it as a hard tail? I'm quite liking it as a hard tail, but I usually have trims on my guitars. Put it through with ah, put it through with string. Hard tail. It, it's kind of suiting this. It is suiting this to be a hard tail. Hmm. Somebody did suggest putting a humbucker in the middle as well, but I don't know if it needs it. Okay. Well, we'll we'll see what happens with the wiring of the three three five. It's gonna be interesting. I know that. <laughs> So, shall I play something? It's all sounding right so far, right? Tell me if you can hear any of this. Where's it gone? Uh, 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 uh,
you like my YouTube show. Can you hear it? middle I love that on its own. Position two. Humbucky. Now, this should be all the pickups. Out of phase middle.
there you go. Backing track, I don't know, I found it. Somewhere. Oh, I've lost you now. So there you go, so that's it in demonstration on the on. <laughs> Needs a life kick. I need something. <laughs> He's out of phase. He's out of phase. <laughs> So yeah, I'm quite digging it. Can you hear my squeaky wah pedal? <laughs> it does, doesn't it? That's because it hasn't been used. I'll stop squeaking it now. It's probably very annoying. <laughs> Music therapy's here. <laughs> Thanks, Lamb, for some lube. <laughs> Kind of goes uh, with the theme of the the title of the um, the thing, doesn't it? With me, we nipples and that. <laughs> WD forty. I got some somewhere. <laughs> so that's really what we what we came in for, wasn't it? So I've showed you my nipples and my knobs, and that they all work perfectly. LEDs next then. So do I need to put LEDs um, on each pickup that's active when I flick the switch? That's going to be difficult, wouldn't it? We can do that. <laughs> oh, you boy! Unicorn tears. I can get some tears out of him. Pretty sure. <laughs> Probably drinking it. <laughs> Barry. <laughs> hola, hola. Freedom for Freddy. Yes, you lot on the Discord. Are we all? Are we all in the Discord? Everybody joined. Have all the hut clubbers joined? I don't want to know. Sorry, I'm just getting the link. Put it in the description, in the chat rather. And then uh, talk about needing more screens. I'm doing all this with one screen. There we go. Yeah, pump. Discord, Discord link. If you're not a member, get in there. But you can ignore the furs. The 
good to have you along. Be good to have you in there. And then you can uh, join my side against Freddy, the unicorn. We don't want him. <laughs> Indeedy. <laughs> Sexy guitar nerds, yeah, sexy man. I'm just about talking about uh, lubrication uh, on my wah and um, my nipples and things. <laughs> He's the only one, is he? <laughs> Is this going to be like, are we going to end up with unicorn merch? First for life, gonna get great. Oh no, <laughs> no. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Good one, Steve. <laughs> Move my camera. My camera keeps moving on its own. It's exactly the same. <laughs> Never mind. We want Freddy merch. <laughs> Okay. What kind of Freddy merch? <laughs> well, the No Unicorn Policy t-shirt. We do it like the Ghostbusters one with Freddy in the middle of it. <laughs> I knew you'd steal it. I knew it. It's going to steal my channel, aren't you? Hate you. That's right, I put all the hard work in. Yeah. Typical unicorn behaviour. strings so we're gonna get the SC kit coming cool looking forward to it t-shirt with furs on it <laughs> oh no SJ's here Smokey Joe I don't know I don't know what we're gonna do about that there's going to be key rings, there's going to be mugs, there's going to be all sorts of weird things, isn't there? Stickers, glow sticks. <laughs> oh, I love this next, great. I've had a couple of PV guitars, they've been really good. I'm getting so cheap as well. First shield picks, yeah. I've got the horn t -shirt. See, look, when, I, when we talked about merch ideas before, when it involved me, we couldn't come up with anything, and now there's a stupid unicorn involved. All the ideas are coming out. Do I need to give him his own channel? Mm -hmm. 
Freddy posters, yeah. There's going to be marches and riots if you don't release him. <laughs> Free Freddy! <sighs> the bet of the devil you riff. No, but what the? Show us the bet of the devil you riff. You know what I mean? Uh, what, as in the... This, the weird thing. Turn my... Turn the light off. So I've got some chips left. <laughs> what bit? You, as in the... Own theme tune, yeah. I'm not sure if it's seven eight or not. Every, every drummer I've had, I've had a few, and even the guy in Russia that I had when we toured, when I toured, couldn't decide what it was. It's like it's almost like seven and a half. it pushes on that last one. Do you see what I'm saying? So drummers have a nightmare with it. I think the the one, one the drummer I had that did the best job was Lewis. He did a really cool thing on it. We'll get him a theme tune. I'll tell you what, I'll let you guys write him a theme tune. <laughs> you want him so bad? <laughs> yeah, PV Next cheap, yeah. You can get the whole guitars for so cheap these days. They're good guitars. Next one's the theme song for Freddy. Yeah, the basses. <laughs> basses have a nightmare with it too. The cop out ones go. <laughs> they do that. A good one follows it. Seven, yeah. It's like four, four, then a, because it's yeah, it's it's weird, because it's like a, it's a push, so it's like a, that's all straight, not that bit straight. Then it pushes there. Do you know what I mean? I wrote it as as to, to I wrote it to be a brass part. It's supposed to be it's supposed to be that, but. I never. I was going to have a, a sax player once upon a time, so I thought it would sound cool, but it, ne it never happened. Never happened. Leo and Dan. Leo and Dan. <laughs> How you doing? The last one. That the unofficial bitch be. Was that the last one that we did? Was that the one we did in what's the name? Where were we? Worthing. Yeah, Dan Electro guitars are all right. They're they're different, aren't they? I've played a couple with the uh, like the plastic bodies with the uh, lipstick type weird pickups, <laughs> and they do stuff like that, don't they? But yeah, they got some good stuff. I like stuff that's different as well, so I do, yeah, I do. Intonation nightmare, yet. Yeah. I had I had a sax player come and um, do a sp uh, like a guest spot once at a gig. It's a female sax player, and at the time we were tuning to E flat, and I forgot to tell her. <laughs> so that you could imagine what that sounded like. I was like, oh shit. When she started playing, I was like, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> we didn't we didn't tell her. We tuned like, you know, Hendrix. <laughs> <laughs> Good stuff, Leo. Yeah, doing alright, you know, just cracking on. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
Oh, the one you posted today. Where was that? Flashfest. Oh, that was... I can't remember. Did we actually pl play that song back there? I don't know. Can't remember. Can't remember who's on drums there. <laughs> My memory's not that good. I think we only played one Flash Fest, didn't we? That was with um, Tom. What am I doing? Tom on drums. That was a while ago then, it was, that must have been a while ago. I think we just finished a tour, didn't we? We were knackered. Finished the tour on a free gig. <laughs> this is the new confusing guitar, yeah. <laughs> I, I know what's going on. Sounds great. <laughs> hey, that's cheating, isn't it, Gunter? Do it. <laughs> Comes down to the knobs. Knobs and the nipples. It's going to be special. Lamb's got something planned for me, haven't you? I was listening to uh, my first album the other night because we've been packing up stuff to move house um, and I found one of my old phones, an old Sony Walkman phone thing that I had 10 years ago so I charged it up and it had my first album on it uh, that I did with Planet Graffiti in 2009 and uh, me and my daughter were listening to it and it's like, it's rocking man <laughs> I was so like not bluesy then it was all rock <laughs> it's a one of a kind this guitar it's going to be a one of a kind for sure um, I'm liking it though I like I like some of the tones I don't like some of them but I like some of them I will do lamb yeah yeah that'd be cool we'll work out what we're going to do with that yeah that'd be awesome hey Glav yeah, that will be good, won't it? See, I really like the... Um, I like it when you have all the pickups on. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out how to do that now. All the pickups on. And then put the middle out of phase. I like that, and you can roll the tone off a little bit on the middle. So that's cool. I do like that. Yeah, I like that. That's a nice sound. I, I, I'm really itching to hear that through my valve amp, you know, just like loud. That could be cool. It's going to become the greatest guitar on YouTube. It will be imbued <laughs> with Spirit of Lamb. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it will be hello. It's going to be the best guitar I've ever messed up. That's for sure.
Uh, Spirit of the Lamb. How's it go? I can't play it, can I? <laughs> Shall I play something out? I want to play something else. I feel like playing. Let me find something. I'm on YouTube backing tracks, so I'll probably get flipping done. But um, there's this one called um, You Shred. Have you ever tried those for playing guitar to? Got some interesting ones. What we got? What do we fancy? Hmm. Let's try a bit of C sharp minor. Eh? An advert might start first, but. Yeah, we'll skip that, thank you. Ooh.
we got oh something's doing it so and so what's this Woo. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
yeah. Are you jamming along? Uh, uh, uh. Goes on forever. It's 15 minutes long, that is. <laughs> Not even I want to do that. Uh, 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 uh. Sorry, I got um, my foot was on the wild pedal and it was squeaky. I couldn't hear it. <laughs> Freddy's almost out. Cool. So we've agreed on merch then. That's a good thing. We'll get some uh, Freddy stuff. We'll get some un <laughs> unicorn stuff. You don't hear anything squeaking. I'm going to do this. <laughs> what note that is? I think it's an F sharp. <laughs> it's almost asthma. It's asthma. You've had the eating asthma. Sooty. It's it's actually Freddy sawing his handcuffs off. <laughs> Apologies. <laughs> Good bit of spit does help in a lot of situations. Asthma. <laughs> it's 
because it hasn't been gigged. It's been sat there. Grease is all dried up, isn't it? I haven't got any in here either, so I'll have to do it tomorrow. I used to have a can of WD-40 up there, but someone stole it. It's gone. Freddie, was it you? Would you like to talk to Freddy for a little while? You can tell him how much you love him. There he is. It's not even, he hasn't even got a real he hasn't even got a good horn, has he? I mean look look at this. <laughs> He's alright. He is an orphan. Keeps his hair nice and trim in lockdown, doesn't he? Done well there. Done well to keep that like that. <laughs> hey, hey, Randy, how you doing? Uh, this may look a bit odd, but this is Freddie, and uh, there's a petition out to save him, apparently. Free him from the evilness that I put upon him. I don't know. We're all going crazy. Blink if you're all right. <laughs> oh. So what colour should I do the guitar when I do it? Or should I do a blowtorch fantastico on it? What are you reckon? Because it's going to have to be done because it's got loads of holes in it. And the scratch plate doesn't fit and things. You weird lot. Kingfisher blue metallic. What? It could be something easy like black. <laughs> Kingfisher blue in metallic. I've never had um, good luck spraying me metallic paint for some reason. Cherry red. Surf green. Hmm. So green might be nice. Surprise! Mysterious is here. I thought you were um going away for a day. Pink and white for Freddy colours. Some burst, burst. Yeah. Day's almost over. You got some, got some work done though. That's the main thing. Hang on, with the black sparkle pit card, what white and pink? <laughs> was that was that what Sorry. What colour did you say? Surf green. Okay, surf green with a black sparkle pit pit card. Could be interesting. Pink and white, the blue script blit. I can't speak. Pink and white, the blue glitter scratch plate. 
the dildo show next door. <laughs> <laughs> No, I don't. I don't ever shield by strats, no. Naughty, aren't I? Should do, really. Yeah, man. You have a guitar in. What's that? Sma. Sap. Smarag? Green? What's that? What is that? What are you doing a bachelor's in? No, what's a dummy coil? Do tell. Emerald... I can't even say that word. Smaragd. Smaragd? Leather. Emerald green. Yeah, that'd be cool. Alright. What did you say it was called? A dummy coil. It's interesting. Smara. How do you say that? Smaragd. Smaragd? Smaragd. I'm a poor talker. I can go. So, anywho, I think, I think it's time to go now. I'm going to have to look that up. I'm interested. A dummy coil. With a hard... <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Pardon me. Anywho, so I think it's time to go because I've run out of things to say, which is unusual for me. It's been a, pardon me, a long day. Um, tomorrow I'm going to do this tomorrow. For for Dirk, <clears throat> because we've been packing up some stuff, <laughs> I found my old teaching file. <laughs> Stay that. It got squashed, and it's got lots of um, useful stuff in it, um, which I used to teach years ago. It's all a bit of a mess. Got like chord charts and stuff, diminished chord types, and augmented chord charts. And diatonic harmony, introduction to diatonic harmony, which is quite cool. Which is right there, that's what I was on about earlier, wasn't I? And loads of other chord charts and triads and smooth doodles and loads of things in here. Walking through diatonic harmony scales. Tablature for Rocket Man, really. Seven C's of A, all this stuff. I'll have to uh, recap myself on it all. Yeah, tons of stuff. So I'll uh, I'll, I'll catalogue all of that and uh, take pictures and send it to you, Dirk. If you're still yeah, you're still here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I shall do that. I'll be doing that tomorrow. Yes, you've seen that, Mark, I think. Yeah, no worries, man. 
see what I can dig out. Anyway, yes, like I said, I think it's a piece till next time because that's the only thing left. So I'm, my microphone's up there, I'm looking at it. Thing to say. Thanks for popping in and seeing me uh, flick my nipples and twist my knobs. Hope it wasn't too boring. <laughs> and we've got Hutch Club, of course, on Thursday. And I will be getting the song a little bit further on. Mysterious Boys song. So peace, everybody. And stay safe. And all that stuff. See you in the Discord.